Now everybody knows about coronavirus. Coronavirus chain is spreading day by day and it's spreading all over the world. The only way to break the chain is isolate the infected and the suspected. Here is how it's spreading and how we can detect the suspected as soon as possible with the help of cell phone tower. Let's assume the red person is an identified COVID positive patient who was present in a particular region under a cell tower in a recent past day. Many other persons were also present in that location around same time frame. So there was a high chance to be infected by the red person. So they are highlighted by orange color and denoted as suspected persons. This layer is denoted as risk layer. While these suspected persons visited other regions located in different cell tower, some other persons were also present at the same time in that location. So there was a chance to spread the infection like a chain. So they are highlighted by yellow color and denoted as assumed persons. This layer is denoted as observation layer. Again, while these assumed persons visited other regions, the other persons present in the location at the same time frame are highlighted by green color and denoted as marked person. They might carry the symptom. This layer is denoted as alert layer. To identify these persons, the service providers can provide past 14 days mobile tower location data of the infected person and his or her surrounded persons for risk layer. Similarly, government can get all the information for observation and alert layers using suspected and assumed persons' location history respectively. And at the end where they are staying currently, government can easily track almost all the possible persons who have the possibility to be infected by coronavirus for checking and isolating purpose. Using such approach, we could avoid several unexpected cases like recently happened in Delhi. This idea is proposed by two IIT graduates, Otonu De and Shujoy Bag, and the video is created by Shubham Panja.